Hey guys, how's it going? Today we're gonna go over how to draw a poison bottle. It's gonna be very simple, very easy, very Halloween, right? Because Halloween's coming up. Uh, but yeah, let's get started. I'm gonna be using two things. I'm using this regular black marker, which I'm gonna put the link in the description. It's a Faber-Castell P-I-T-T artist pen. And also this magic marker right here, which you can buy literally anywhere. It's Crayola and it's the green color. And that is it, these two. So let's go. If you don't have green, you can use another color. But uh, preferably, you need a black uh, marker or a, um, or at least like a pen. So let's get started. I'm going to start with a small curve for kind of the lip of uh, the bottle or the open bottle, essentially. Well, not the open, but the, the bottle. Other side. I'm going to pull down a line here, and it's going to have a bottle cork in it. Pull a line down here. Line across line across the top and I'm gonna throw little dots in this like cork tends to have then I'm gonna pull a line down here on the left side a line down here we're gonna go into the actual bottle itself and this time I'm gonna make that shape of a the bottle there's different ways to make the bottle somewhere like beakers right but I just chose to make this type because I thought it was uh, you know a decent shape so you just follow that shape, it, it should be relatively easy. And reaches the bottom here, and then we're gonna connect those lines up. Okay. What I'm gonna do here now is I'm gonna draw a skull, a very cartoony skull. So I'm gonna draw a circle, pulling down, left, up, down, left, up. It's like this could be one middle one, I don't know. And it's supposed to represent a skull, so I'm gonna draw two dots here and dot in the center. So it you know has creates that skull shape, but it's extremely simplified. And then I'm gonna draw with my marker here. I'm gonna draw a wavy line here. And then on the inside, I'm gonna actually trace the exact same shape. And so there's a thickness to the glass of the bottle, all right? And so that thickness kind of comes out in this cartoon here. All right. And so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna grab my green. What I should do is let this dry, but this is a demonstration, so I'm probably not gonna do that. Um, actually, I'll do one little thing. I put another wavy line so it looks like it has a little detail with that liquid in there. And I'm gonna use the green and I'm gonna flatly color this, essentially what we have is the liquid inside. I'm just gonna do a flat, it doesn't need to be fancy. Um, be aware of when you, if for, if for some of you, if you touch the black marker here with this, it might smear it. So I would probably let it dry just a little bit. If not, just go into it and risk it. It's fine. Just kind of be careful. Going in more here. Just coloring it flat. While I'm doing this, please do me a favor and subscribe. Uh, when you subscribe, it brings a lot of cool energy to the channel and it becomes very exciting. Uh, Halloween is upon us, so I'm very happy about this. Uh, well, kind of. You know, the season's its like a month and a half away, but, you know, we're starting early. But we want to bring it in stronger. That's why we're spreading uh, the cheer through all the videos and well, all the lessons. I'm going to throw a weekend show on there as well. Uh, and that's pretty much it. What you could do, and I might actually do this right now, is I, I forgot the cork was in here, so I'm going to grab an actual orange out of my... I'm using this, by the way, like I said, this thing was like three bucks. Um, I'm gonna grab an orange and I'm gonna put this for the cork because I think that's important. But you don't need to have it. And that is it, that's a poison bottle. I hope you found that easy. Hopefully it was very, you know, exciting. Uh, and I will talk to you later on. Talk to you soon.